Hi, this is Randy Rolf from the Institute for Creative Solutions, sharing foundational concepts about vibrant health through natural living. And what I want to talk about today is getting your children ready for school. It's that time of year, yet again, whole ready. And the most important thing that you can do as a parent is to really check the environment in which they will be dealing with their school. And so the first thing is to have a good breakfast. They need protein at breakfast. Otherwise, they're going to look for some kind of snack before it's lunchtime. They're going to lose focus in so many cases and be bored or overactive because their body has run out of energy. So you need some protein at breakfast. Next is to think about whether it's oatmeal or cheese or eggs, uh, whatever the children uh, do best eating for breakfast. Uh, and then think about their lunch. What kind of lunch are they going to get at school? The schools have really compromised tremendously. They're letting uh, third party food suppliers uh, bring in food that's cheap for the school's budgets, uh, fast food. And they say, well, the kids won't eat the vegetables, so we'll just give them pizza and, and uh, mac and cheese. Uh, so if you are in that kind of situation, be sure that the breakfast is good and that you also plan a real high quality snack when they get home. If they're in a situation where they can take their lunch, then do uh, with them, make the lunch for them, with them, so that they see what you're putting in and, and want to have it. Uh, so let them help make the decision, but also choose from real foods. Don't just say, oh yeah, you can have the, the Twinkies or whatever. Um, give them a choice, but among real foods for lunch that they're taking to school. And then uh, when they get home, have a, a good snack for them and don't let them eat too late. Prepare dinner at a reasonable time. I know parents are so busy, have their own jobs, but when you get home, again, use real food. Uh, it's very uh, good to learn how to make simple foods quickly for your children. Um, and then the next thing is to Make sure they get to bed, that they don't eat within two hours of sleep because they won't sleep very well if their digestion's still working, and get to sleep, uh, you know, by ten or nine. Kids in school need an amazing amount of sleep. The school is as big a stress or more than our grown-up jobs, and we have to constantly remind ourselves of that. So they come home just as tired and irritable and hungry and thirsty as we do, or more so. So get them a good dinner, uh, make sure they eat enough so they're not going to snack on junk before bed, and make sure that they get their digital things at least six feet away from their bed. Um, because it messes with their natural energy field and they won't sleep as well. So they won't get the rejuve rejuvenating um, effects of good sleep. Uh, and then uh, give them time to wake up in the morning so that they do have time for breakfast and they do have time to, to plan their lunch and uh, so on. And then the other piece I want to include is space. Help them now before they start school to organize where they're going to do their homework or their reading or their art project. Um, find them space within the home, within the family's living space. If it's in their room, if they like working in their room, that's fine. There were times when I was a kid, I wanted to work at the dining room table instead of at the desk in my bedroom. So help them decide what kind of environment is going to give them enough space, enough quiet, um, that they can actually focus on what they have to do at home. Um, from their school. And the last advice is remember that you're the parent. You don't have to be the mini teacher that enforces everything the teacher says. Let the child develop the relationship with their duties and the people they know at school. Uh, certainly be there to help explain or solve problems for them, but listen and let them talk out their problems. Don't just go fix it real quick. So 
um, those are my suggestions for getting ready for school. And uh, I'll talk to you soon. Thanks.